Hey everyone, welcome back to the place we are testing every single mask in the world. And today we are looking at the Demitech five pack fold N95 respirator. That's right, you can get an N95 and a five pack. It's nicely folded. Didn't know it was possible, neither did I. Not true because we're selling these on our website, so I actually was very aware of that. All right, uh, let's get it in the clamper and see what it does. So this is a different setup, as I keep saying, if you're watching these uh, chronologically than we're normally doing because these are N95s. And so you gotta do something a little bit different. Now this setup is not what NIOSH would be doing for the TSI machine. I'm doing this because I'm lazy and don't like dealing with beeswax. So we created this little thing here. We put that on top, look at that. Done, I can test so fast. Um, because of that, like we're having to do a little bit more math to get to the real numbers here, but I promise you, the nerds are telling me, I promise you, at least the nerds are telling me that it's correct, so let's hope so. Right, let's see how this bad boy goes. All right, this is a PFE machine, particulate filtration efficiency machine. We are using uh, salt, basically, in this NACL uh, to, uh, to shoot through the mask and, and test to see how well it's doing. Um, one thing that we want to uh, really take a look at here is the airflow resistance. Um, this is something that's going to talk about breathability. Now, N95s can be under 250 and still pass the NIOSH test. Look at this guy, 137. That's great. Love it. All right, let's skip off. I don't want to give too much away. Let's look at the actual listing. So this is on Demotech's website. You can see the uh, five pack on there. You can go to demotech.com. US or you can go on our website and get the same thing. It's totally up to you, whatever you want to do. Um, but really excited to partner with Demotech on this and be able to offer a real American made, verified by me personally, uh, N95s while we are waiting for our NIOSH certification. I've said this before, but you know, one of the, a lot of people, a lot of manufacturers, Politicians even come to our factory and they say like, hey, aren't you upset that NIOSH takes so long to get things done? I don't think so. When you see N95 on a box, and not, you know that NIOSH has actually gone and tested that item and that it's passing their very, very high bar. So that's the whole point of the, the process. You want it to be annoying. All right, let's take a look at this. So it comes in this nice uh, bag here, which so yeah, so yeah, opened. Um, it's nice, it's convenient. It's a uh, it's a resealable pouch, so you can like you know put these in your fanny pack or something like that if you need to. Um, it's got all the information made in the USA right there. This is uh, this is after the what's called the KN95 design, so it's going to look like that. The difference you're going to notice is it's got these uh, head head straps instead of the the N95 goes around or KN95 is around your ears. This is around your head. Well, why is this different? Is it better? No one knows. No, it is better. It's better on the. Uh, better on the fit. It's going to give you a much better seal. That's not going to hurt your uh, ears either. So uh, a lot of people prefer the CAN95 style. I actually don't personally. I like the cup respirator for whatever reason. But dang, that is a really good seal. That is a really good seal. I like that. I'm feeling a good seal. And man, that, no that nose wire that's in there is just so good. This is obviously a lot more efficient to make because of how it's made in a single line instead of where the cup is made. Yeah, that's really good. It's kind of tight though. And kind of like the other Demotex, messing up my hair. Kind of like a lot of the other Demotex, that the cup was that the, uh, I, fe I felt it to be like a really, really tight on my head. Now, N95 has got to have that quality seal. And so that's part of it. But I've, I've tested some of these other ones here. Uh, if you have a really, really big head, I probably would not recommend uh, the uh, this for you. I would go with a, a different brand. Um, but if you have a really, really small head, I would definitely recommend this. I mean, some of my kids have really big heads. This might work really well for them, to be honest. Um, good mask. Let's try the, uh, let's try the ear loops out here. Or not ear loops, uh, head strap. Use the right terminology. That's great. All day long. I can do this all day long. It ain't breaking. It ain't breaking. That's a good, look at that. That's insane. There's a, you, one thing I've noticed, I haven't even talked about smell. There's no smell in any of these things. Seriously, it's like, nothing. Like seriously, nothing. That's interesting, I wonder why. Like you'd think that like with the glue process of the, uh, the, uh, the, nose, or the, the nose foam that there would be a smell, but there's not. Um, all right, 
But does any of that subjective stuff matter if it doesn't protect you? Let's check out the, uh, the PFE machine here. 99.78. Wow. 99.78. Actually, I'm checking, checking. That's the best score we've gotten so far. 99.78. Nice job. Super breathable. Top scores. Fits in your purse with a Ziploc bag. Hard to go wrong. Nice job, Demotech, on that. You get the gold star, ding, for being one of the better ones. All right, thank you guys so much for watching. If you're just joining us, we're doing all the N95s that are made in America. So stick with us. Love to see you on the